Taking over every bit of space available, taking over the masses, it don't matter Getting this party lit in the most precise sense like we started the fire I am weak, lapai, amari semma, suda na matter, yo paari nga vaya Rocket ki tezi idar, to janta ki soch badalti hai ab Mas se pehle hi mas pohon jate hum, to masti mein sub Live extreme with force, unstoppable and the subjects are movable Jwala hai rugby ki jalwa, ujala na measure up hoga in numerals Haak maga step po, number is uprati on the gali alo hek po Look at me chep po, my competition at a white po Ek kada chudu, I'm probably gonna wreck you I'm willing to kill everybody in the game, display the levels of my villainy And it's epitome, with the attributes that I possess, got you feeling like To be this special is a felony Live extreme boy, live it, live extreme boy It's the vibe, it's the new kid in the scene boy Live extreme boy, like the silver screen boy Rocket give me this, red me K, 50 I Live extreme boy, live it, live extreme boy It's the vibe, it's the new kid in the scene boy Live extreme boy, like the silver screen boy Rocket give me this, red me K, 50 I
Hey, good afternoon everyone. Welcome to a brand new day with brand new possibilities. I am Sumit Sonil and I work with the marketing team at Xiaomi India. And I am here in front of all of you today to mark Redmi's foray into the tablet segment. But before I do that, let me give you a quick recap of what's been happening in the tablet segment from the brand Xiaomi. Earlier this year, in April specifically, we introduced the Xiaomi Pad 5, which marked our re-entry into the tablet segment. We spent over two years to build the Pad 5 with one core vision. And the core vision was to revive the Android tablet segment, which was mostly plagued by bad products, leaving users without an upgrade path. But were we able to do that? The answer is a big, big yes. The Xiaomi Pad 5 today is the highest rated Android tablet on the Amazon platform with an overall rating of 4.6 across 1800 plus customer reviews. Not just that, each and every component that we spoke about during the launch, whether it be the display quality, the quad speakers, or even the touch response has been rated above 4.3 individually. Now this love made us the highest selling tablet till date on launch day on the Amazon platform. Now, not just our Mi fans, but our media friends also absolutely loved the product and went on to say that you cannot go wrong with the Xiaomi Pad 5. But like I was mentioning earlier, our aim was one, and that was to give our India Mi fans the right upgrade path in the 20 to 30,000 segment. And I can proudly say that, that as a team, we have been able to achieve that. But today, I am not here to talk about the upgraders, but to talk about that customer who is looking to buy their first tablet this festive season. But you know what? Quite honestly, buying your first tablet is a very difficult journey. And there are two main reasons behind this. Number one is too many options from all the leading brands that leave you confused about which tablet is right for you. The second problem is wrong component combinations, which is even more problematic. Let me give you a quick example. Imagine that we were building a PC. I give you the latest processor, the best-in-class GPU, the best-in-class RAM, but I give you a hard disk drive instead of a SSD. The hard disk drive will become the bottleneck in this scenario and will ruin the overall experience of the product. Now, wrong product combinations can also be seen just like the example which I gave you in also the 10 to 20,000 rupees tablet segment. Let me show you two quick examples. The first example would be the Realme Pad, which actually comes with a decent display and decent audio, but comes with an outdated processor. Launched in 2021, the Realme Pad actually features a processor which is more than two years old. Now, it might be a great tablet for entertainment, but when it comes to anything else, whether it be light gaming or even slight multitasking, it will almost immediately start stuttering. The second example would be Lenovo's M10 FHD, which has actually hit end of life this year and is still shipping with Android 10 out of the box. The second problem with this particular tablet is its battery itself, which will leave you connected to the wall more than to your content because of its 5000 mAh battery. And today, I am going to tell you how with the Redmi Pad, we are going to solve these two big problems, which have mostly plagued the entire budget tablet segment. Introducing the Redmi Pad, which aims to become the right choice for all your entertainment, gaming, e-learning and browsing needs. Now we are introducing the Redmi Pad in three brand new colors, the Graphite Grey, the Moonlight Silver, and a brand new and our flagship color, mint green. Now, Redmi Pad features a metal design, which is a combination of magnesium and aluminum alloy. At just 465 grams, it is as light as the iPad Air and is one of the lightest and the slimmest tablet in the budget segment. Now, we have specifically worked on the weight distribution across the device as our new users will be using this device for longer hours. Now, most of the people we showed the Redmi Pad 2 said that it feels as light as a phone. The second thing which we worked upon was defining and refining its contoured edges so that it comfortably sits in your hands without leaving a dent in your palm. 
And because of all this emphasis on design, Redmi Pad excels across almost every single use case scenario when it comes to first-time tablet buyers. Now, we are changing today's launch format a little. Now, instead of telling you just its specs and hardware configurations, today, you and I will be looking at these use case scenarios of the first-time tablet buyers and then connect the product back into it. Now, the four main use case scenarios for the first-time tablet buyers are entertainment, browsing, shopping, e-learning, and gaming. Let's first talk about entertainment. The Redmi Pad features a super bright 10.6-inch display, making it one of the largest displays in the segment. Now, before I tell you more about this beautiful display, let's quickly see how the content landscape has evolved in the last two years. Most of the content which we see today has been shot with specialized equipment in higher resolutions. Even local and vernacular content today is shot the same way in higher resolutions, giving you more detail in each and every frame. To ensure that we deliver the right content experience to our first-time tablet buyers, we are happy to introduce a 2K resolution on the Redmi Pad, which will deliver sharper visuals across your favorite movies and TV shows. The next big addition to your entertainment requirements is a billion color display enabled by a 10-bit display panel for punchy colors and vivid contrast. Now, visuals are just half the story. To deliver a complete entertainment package, we have a quad speaker setup on the Redmi Pad with independent drivers and independent acoustic chambers to deliver the right loudness and punch for all the content you consume on it. We are also bringing in system-wide Dolby Atmos, expanding the soundstage and delivering theater-like experience from the comfort of your couch. Your Redmi Pad is also equipped with Widevine L1 certification to ensure that all your favorite content is decoded right and delivered to you in the highest resolution. Now, we know that majority of our users absolutely love YouTube and rely on it every day for their music and video needs. Hence, to sweeten your audio-visual experience on the Redmi Pad, we are extending two months of YouTube Premium absolutely free of cost. Now, let's talk about the importance of storage in your entertainment needs. Today, majority of the OTT platforms allow you to download your favorite shows and movies and see them on the go. Even the games which we download today take plenty of space, running into almost over 5 GB for all the leading titles. Hence, to ensure that you never run out of storage, the Redmi Pad will feature 128 GB of storage on the top variant. And not just that, you can also add additional storage by using an SD card, which allows you to further expand the storage. Isn't that awesome? Now, with a beautiful display, brilliant audio, and access to your favorite content, we knew that you would want to binge through almost everything. And hence, the Redmi Pad comes with 8000 mAh battery in a slim format, which gives you over 21 plus hours of video playback and over 8 plus days of music playback. Now, here is a quick comparison of the Redmi Pad with the competition brands under the use case of entertainment. As you can see, the Redmi Pad leads the pack by combining the best hardware and the best software features, making it the right choice for all your entertainment needs. Now, let's look at the second biggest use case scenario amongst our first-time tablet buyers, which is browsing and shopping. And to ensure that we deliver a seamless browsing experience, we are bringing a tall body design with a 15 is to 9 aspect ratio, which ensures that all your favorite websites scale well and there is no display real estate which gets wasted. So all the articles you read, all the reels and the shots you consume scale beautifully across this entire display. Not just that, we wanted each and every scroll to feel absolutely buttery smooth, whether it be the UI or in-app content. And to deliver on that promise, we are introducing segments first, 90 Hz adaptive sync refresh rate on the Redmi Pad. Now, let's talk about some shopping as I'm sure that this Diwali season, each one of us has spent a lot of time looking for deals on our favorite products. 
And we also know that our customers are smart. They compare and then they buy. And to aid that comparative shopping journey, we are also bringing in the best of multitasking features with MIUI for Pad. With MIUI for Pad, you can now divide your screen and run instances of your favorite shopping apps side by side. You can also add a floating window, for instance, the calculator in this video to quickly compare discount and seal the deal. Now, all of this is only possible because of MIUI, which has been specifically designed and optimized for the Redmi Pad. Now, here is a quick comparison of the Redmi Pad with competition brands under the use case of browsing and shopping. And as you can see, the Redmi Pad again leads the pack by offering the largest 10.6 inch display with a 15 is to 9 aspect ratio, making it the best device for vertical or horizontal content consumption. The Redmi Pad today also sets a benchmark in its price segment by introducing 90 Hz adaptive sync refresh rate and the 8000 mAh battery, making it the clear winner and the right choice for all your shopping and browsing needs. Now, let's look at the next big use case scenario amongst our first-time tablet buyers and amongst our younger users, which is e-learning. During our internal study at Xiaomi, we saw that 52% of the people we surveyed use their tablets for reading e-books and 49% use their tablets for their kids' education. Now, e-learning, if you quite honestly ask me, has come a long way since the start of the pandemic. And today, we see more and more young users picking up their first tablets for attending online lectures and classes, digitizing their notes, which they can share with their friends and much more. To ensure that the Redmi Pad delivers a great e-learning experience, we are bringing in a full HD 8 megapixel front camera with a 105 degree wide field of view to make you look good in all your video calls and online lectures. Not just you, but your friends can also look super good when they join you for these video calls with our brand new camera feature addition, which we are calling Focus Frame. Focus Frame ensures that you are always in the center of the frame and automatically adjust the frame when more and more people join in. We have also built in a dual microphone system which ensures that not only you are seen clearly, but you are also heard very, very clearly on the other side. Now, with notes being one of the most important part of the student's learning journey, we are bringing an 8 megapixel rear snapper equipped with an inbuilt document scanner so that digitizing your classroom notes and sharing them becomes super, super easy. The Redmi Pad also features MIUI enabled reading mode for all you bookworms out there just like me. To support those long hours of e-learning and reading, the display also comes with TUV Rhineland certification that reduces the blue light emission from the screen, protecting your eyes from strain and fatigue. You also get the support for your favorite Microsoft Office apps, which allow you to seamlessly transfer files from your PC and edit or even make presentations and documents on the go. The Redmi Pad also supports majority of the third-party capacitive stylus and pencils for taking notes to help you start on your brand new e-learning journey. Now, let's quickly see how Redmi Pad stacks against the competition when it comes to e-learning. As you can see, the Redmi Pad leads the under 20,000 segment with a 10.6 inch large display, a full HD front camera coupled with the new focus frame feature. Additionally, it sports a 8 megapixel rear camera with inbuilt document scanner and a reading mode. This makes the Redmi Pad the right choice for all your e learning needs. Now let's talk about gaming, which is a very sensitive and an unheard topic in the budget tablet category. And why won't it be? Most of the tablets in the market come with an outdated processor, which means that they are never going to deliver that kind of performance which is required for gaming on a tablet. Now this becomes even more obvious when we see the comparison of performance to price ratio in the most competitive tablets of this particular segment. To give you an example, let's look at the Lenovo M10 FHD Plus, which is powered by MediaTek Helio P22T processor, launched way back in May 2018 and manages to deliver an Antutu score of only 94,000. To solve for this industry-wide problem, we are introducing MediaTek Helio G99, a gaming-centric chipset for the very first time in the tablet avatar. 
Launched in May 2022, this octa-core chipset is based on 6 nanometer process technology, which makes it extremely power efficient. It has two Cortex A76 cores clocked at 2.2 GHz and six Cortex A55 cores clocked at 2 GHz each, which efficiently drive that beautiful 2K 90 Hz display, giving the Redmi Pad the right combination of a great display, smooth UI with high refresh rate and powerful processing capabilities for the right gaming experience on a tablet. That's not all. To add to this well-rounded component combination, we have up to 6 GB of LPDDR4X RAM with UFS 2.2 storage going up to 128 GB. The Redmi Pad also brings in faster Wi-Fi speeds with dual-band Wi-Fi allowing it to interface with two different frequencies, 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz, making the Redmi Pad less prone to interference from other devices at home and even in classrooms. Along with dual-band Wi-Fi, the Redmi Pad also features Bluetooth 5.3 for seamless connectivity and low latency. And it also supports all your wireless earphones, keyboard and mice. Now, let's look at how Redmi Pad stacks against the competition. With a large 10.61-inch display, a gaming-centric MediaTek Helio G99, segment-leading and segment-first 90Hz adaptive sync refresh rate, a 2K resolution, the Redmi Pad again leads the pack against all the other players in the market. Now, we know how important software support is for a device that you will use for a longer period of time. Redmi Pad will come with MIUI 13 on top of Android 12 right out of the box. We are also promising three years of security updates, two versions of Android updates, and MIUI updates for across over three years. So that was the Redmi Pad with the gaming-centric MediaTek Helio G99, segments first 90Hz adaptive sync refresh rate, a 2K resolution with a billion colors, quad speaker with Dolby Atmos and a mammoth 8000 mAh battery with 18 watt fast charging support, Redmi Pad is the right choice for all your entertainment, gaming, browsing and e-learning needs. Now, let's talk about its pricing and its availability. The Redmi Pad 3GB RAM plus 64GB storage variant will be available at just 14,999. But wait, that's not all. We have a special introductory pricing of just 12,999. The 4GB and 128GB storage variant will be available at just 17,999. And once again, we have a special introductory price of just 14,999. Last but not the least, the flagship variant with 6GB RAM and 128GB of storage will be available at just 19,999. And the special introductory offer brings down the price to just 16,999. But that's not all. You can also avail an additional bank offer of 10% on all the three variants, bringing the effective price of 3GB plus 64GB variant to just 11,700. The 4GB plus 128GB storage variant will come down to just effectively 13,500. And the 6GB, 128GB storage variant will be available at just 15,300 only. So when can you buy it? We have planned for an exclusive early bird sale of the mint green variant, which is our flagship variant, which will start on me.com tomorrow at 10 a.m. And the first sale for all the other variants will start at 12 noon across me.com, Flipkart, Me Home, and all the other retail outlets. So that was the brand new Redmi Pad for you with which you can also purchase an exclusive flip case so that you can binge, read, learn and game comfortably while protecting your tablet from any nudges or any scratches. Follow our social media handles to know more about its pricing and availability. Thank you for joining us today. This is Sumit signing off and I will see you at the next one.